is is no different than any other city. It's extremely safe. Outgoing Truman Police Chief Chad Henson says his town has gotten a bad reputation over the years. Crime migrates. We are doing proactively what every other city can do. The most recent crime to make headlines, a robbery at Walmart. Police are still looking for that suspect. Just another crime, adding to what appears to be a high crime rate. The 2018 crime data from the FBI shows that Truman had a crime rate of 59 per 1,000 residents, a much higher rate compared to other cities in the state. And Henson says it's not a fair representation. A town's population factors into the rate, which is calculated by adding crimes against person to crimes against property and dividing by the population. Small communities like Truman, which has a population of just over 7,000, are at a disadvantage. Every nine years, our population goes down. And while other cities grow and add more people, it's not the case for Truman. So some cities report housing to make it look like their population goes up, but for cities like Paragool and Jonesboro, who have a hospital, their births go up and their their deaths kind of work itself out. Henson also noted that Truman reports every crime is voluntary, so not every city does the same. So they clearly warn about uh, using the voluntary data from, let's say, Truman, Jonesboro, Paragol, to try and formulate an opinion and then come up with some type of number. Henson says that Truman is one out of 15 police departments accredited in the state, meaning auditors check to make sure they are handling crime properly. John Redmond will take over as the new chief on Friday. He says Redmond has been hands on with crime issues already, but they are still looking to improve the department and progress. And what is going to be handed over to Chief Redmond is, is he's going to try and progress. And that may be changes. Uh, that may be the way that uh, he operates his shifts to the, the way the cars look like, to the way that he interacts with citizens. But again, change is good. Progression is good. Redmond says that it is extremely hard to stop violent crimes, but they are doing everything they can, including extra patrol. They take preventative measures by promoting programs like See Something, Say Something and Citizens Police Academy. They have also worked with pharmacies to lock up medication and have placed drug drop-off boxes around the city.